What's going on guys? Today I want to talk about a software on the my PC called Wallpaper Engine. So this is sort of a video background app that you can get off Steam. It's about $3.99, for $4.99, something like that. I don't remember exactly how much it costs. But so you can get live wallpapers. So you like, can get visualizers, ones that move, that are compatible. Like when you click the screen, it'll show something. Or ones that are just static, like a video that just plays on loop in the background. So you get a playlist of wallpapers that it'll cycle through, depending on if you like multiple of them at once. I've got three in the playlist in the bottom right corner. Here's another visualizer. And then you can adjust the responsiveness of the visualizer so you can get more of an effect or less of an effect depending on what you like. And here's another one. So this does take a little bit of processing power on your computer. So if you've got an older computer that really doesn't have a lot in it, I would not recommend getting this software. This one's one of my favorites. So these are all completely customizable. You can change the colors in a lot of these if they allow you to. You can just create your own. If you don't like the ones that are available, you can just take an existing one and use it as a template and completely change it. It's totally an open source software. So you can change the color of the car and other things like that if you like this sort of thing. Then you can get one made by Corsair. You can get that will work with IQ compatible peripherals from Corsair. And I'll show you some video of that later. It looks fantastic. So here's the stores. So if you want to get more, you don't like the ones that it comes with, you could download as many of these as you like. Most of them are free. I think some of them you could charge for, but I've never seen any that are paid for or gotten any that are paid for. So we can get another one here. So that's all you have to do to get a new one and download it and get it going. So this one actually has audio that comes along with it. So it'll play the audio loop and then if you, depending on what you tell it to do, it'll go on to the next wallpaper after the video is done or just keep repeating it. So let me pause this real quick. So it'll just play this in the background while your desktop's up. You may or may not like that. You can tell it to not play the audio if you still like the background. So that's fine. So then if you go to the settings, you could tell it to, for instance, stop running the app and just shut down wallpaper engine if you put something into full screen, like a game. Like you want to save, save on your GPU and CPU while you're gaming so you have it turned off when it's full screen. Or you could have it so it puts a lower priority on processing it, so it'll put other things first if you've got a slower computer. I haven't noticed any problems on mine, but that's kind of a weird case because I've got 99 and 2080 Ti in my computer so I don't think I notice anything anyways. So here you can create your own wallpapers, just use templates that are already available. And then it will start up every time. Here's how you select plugins to use if you've got things that are compatible with it. I believe Razer software is compatible with it. IQ uses. So here's some footage of what it looks like on my keyboard and mouse pad. I'm sorry about the video quality. So you can see the lines from the background will continue on to the keyboard, the mouse pad, the mouse, the headphone stand, and the fans, RAM, everything inside of the case. And I want to give a big shout out to Young Mass for providing the music for this video. You can check his page out on SoundCloud in the link below. And if this will focus, you can see the fans. It looks a lot better in person. The fans and everything light up with any, any one of these backgrounds that are IQ compatible. Not all of them are. This one is. So let me change the visualizer and show you that. It looks quite good on this. So the visualizer on the screen will match up with what's going on in the keyboard, the mouse pad, and the fans inside the computer. I think for $4.99 this app is definitely worth it. This isn't a paid promotion, I'm not paid to say this. I'm doing this because I love this app and I had never heard of it until I saw this happened upon it on uh, Steam. So yeah, not all of these are IQ compatible. They have to be told to be IQ compatible. Uh, there's about 10 or 12 that I've seen that will work with IQ. I, there's a lot more because there's thousands and thousands of wallpapers on here. I just don't have all of them and haven't looked through all of them. So thanks for watching the video and subscribe for more.